Hey guys, I'm so excited to be showing you our atoms. So we have, this is my workspace by the way, like this is where it all happens, all the magic happens. Um, lots of things are going on. Um, and I'm really excited about our little bags of atoms, that's what we call them. Um, they could also be called items for your sand trays. And there are 21 items that come in these little bags and they're really, really well tightened. So they're difficult to open, nothing's gonna fall out. And I feel like they're very compatible for both adult work and children's work. And for example, all of them are gonna have a card. And so there's numbers and letters that children can identify with, but also the symbolism of, of, of gaming or poker or gambling or anything like that, that might come along with that. Children, this is a hair curler. I've got a shell in here. I have um, some other basic things that are very fluid in terms of like what someone might interpret them as, which I just love how that works in sand tray work. Um, a wine cork could be something celebratory. It could also represent um, someone that they re remember some of an al alcoholism or abusing alcohol and um, a piece of nature. So we've got an acorn as well as just a shell. Um, this is really fun. It's just a little um, paper nail. And then I've got some different little people in here. We have an army guy a little red kind of monster truck type of guy. This is ceramic doll, which again, very fluid in terms of what she could represent, childhood, um, playing, um, coldness with her ceramic sides. Um, then the little children that are foam as well. Ceramic floral, teeny weeny little star. And also the sizes and, and shapes are all different also, which is really good because as you'll see with doing sand tray work, um, you can say, well, you know, the star is the smallest thing you picked. What is that? What does that mean? Why is that important? And then a key, oh, so symbolic, a penny, a marble, into the marble, a number, a cross um, and bones, a piece of a puzzle, a wishbone, isn't that the cutest thing you've ever seen? Oh my gosh. Um, a flower, a button, and a gear. So these are amazing and they're extremely fun and extremely versatile and I absolutely love doing sand tray work. I do it in family therapy, individual therapy, children's therapy. I've done it with trauma. Um, it can be used in sexual assaults. It's such good work. And um, so as you'll see with my product line, I have these for sale. And I also have the whole kit. So you get a sand tray and a kit of these and as well as the sand. And that will come into the mail to you. Um, please visit my Etsy shop and for more details or certainly you can send me an email and I will get you more instructions. Thanks. Bye.